How much pressure is it in those professional kitchens? Serious. A serious amount of pressure, because as much as you cook at home, nothing can prepare you for that sort of precision at that speed. Is it the mm. time pressure that is the thing that makes them sweat? More than anything else, mm. yes. And you like this lot, don't you? You think they are a nice bunch of people, not just good potential chefs. I like to think, you know, obviously believe we're impartial judges, but just like anybody you work with, there are going to be some people you like more than others. Yeah. Right? Uh, and and I, how hard particularly, is it? I think they're lovely. How I think hard is it then when you really like someone and they're really bad? <laughs> and oh. then when you really can't get on with someone I've and seen, I've seen this big tough Aussie almost in tears of frustration oh. when there's someone that we really, really like who's decided one day they're going to melt a chocolate bar over a piece of fish. Yeah. If they do something crazy, there's nothing we can do. You they, they, can do know. chocolate over mints, can't you? But you can't do over fish. And what I mean... Susanna, no, stop <laughs> it. Sorry, where, where are we going? <laughs> stop, no, stop now. Are you, apply, are you applying for Celebrity MasterChef? <laughs> <laughs> Don't do it. Chocolate really mint. mints either. <laughs> yeah. so the, I think it's mint you're talking about, not mints. That must have been what yeah. was in the recipe. Yeah. I wonder why the children <laughs> would need it. Uh, can I take you back to... Because uh, you do have disagreements, don't you, about who should win. And it's a good job Michaela Strachan was doing at the competition today because wasn't Andy Peters one of your mm. most controversial losers? You both... Had a different opinion. I about... think the most controversial one was Hardeep Singh Kohli and Matt uh, Dawson. Matt Dawson. But yeah, we also disagreed over over Andy. Who backed Andy? In you did. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who won? <laughs> Who won? <laughs> Who did win that year? Uh, it was Liz, Liz McLaren, wasn't McClellan. it? It was from yeah. Atomic yeah. Kitten. Yes. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I, I, I remember the. Yeah, I wanted. I wanted Andy. Mm. I mean, everyone's got their own opinion about food, haven't they? You know, and, and I think that's right to have that opinion. Yeah. I think if we if we didn't fall out occasionally which we do, then it wouldn't be right, would it, the judging? It would mean that we didn't care enough. Shows your passion. So, listen, Greg, you better root out your recipes for pureed carrot and broccoli pretty soon because you're about to have a little baby one, aren't uh, you? Sid, baby, pretty soon. Baby Sid's on his, on his way. Wow. You know he's going to be How can you name a baby before it arrives? Because I've seen the scans. I know what he looks like. He's, <laughs> a, he's a Sid. <laughs> he's a Sid. He Don't like all a Sid. babies look like a Sid? Well, no, Sid was, <laughs> Sid was my granddad's name. Oh. And so he looks like your granddad. Well, yeah, oh. kind of. Oh, that's kind, kind, kind of. When I saw the first scan, actually, he looked like a young Napoleon. But that didn't go down well with my Anna. <laughs> so, or, so and and congratulations to you as well. Yeah. About time. You got down on bended knee at Christmas. I did, yes, and, I, and she said yes, oh. which was really lovely. Oh. She, in fact, she didn't say yes for three and a half hours. Really? What? Well, because she was so gobsmacked. She didn't actually... And I, I ended up saying to her, are you going to say yes? She went, oh, have I not said yes? I said, no, you have not said yes yet. So three and a half hours. She made you sweat like you do the contestants. Yes, yeah, she, she did. She did her revenge. Yeah. But that... the other thing, she was so frustrated because we're in a different time zone and she didn't, couldn't ring anybody and tell them. Oh. Anyway. Well, congratulations. Thank you very much. Have you got, have you got plans sorted out for the actual wedding? Well, sort of. Things are sort of moving in the right direction. We're, we're quite busy. We're filming Celeb at the moment. Is Greg going to do the catering? I was going to say the food better be good. <laughs> no, no, well, well, I am. Go I've been invited. <laughs> oh, that's oh, enough. He's going to sit enough. down. He's going to sit down. You're going to bring Sid. Bring baby Sid? Yeah. yeah. Actually, I might leave Sid with the grandmother. OK. Oh. All right, because I think we might have to have a bit of a celebration. OK. Um, mm. Well, it, obviously, lots of reasons to celebrate. You're also filming Celeb MasterChef at the moment. Mm. With, with real MasterChef, you know that they're all talented. With Celeb MasterChef, you might have your doubts. When you put the food in your mouth, do you ever worry well, what it, it might it, do it, to it, you? It's watching them cook. You see, you've got to watch them cook. Right. And if you watch them cook and you see something slightly dangerous, like chocolate over mints, yeah. Yeah. you know... You wouldn't, <laughs> you, wouldn't, you wouldn't dare do that. No. Oh, but, I don't know. Uh, I think uh, it might be missing a trick there, John. Are you going to go and do it, Susanna, and prove them wrong? Yeah. Do, you fancy, do you fancy it? Next time we come on, yeah. if you can bring it with I'll a bit of... I'll do my chocolate mint. With a bit of toast? <laughs> yeah, we get everybody, in the, everybody here to taste it and actually understand what it's like to be it's, a MasterChef judge. It's great to see you. Uh, MasterChef, tonight... Tonight. Yeah. What time, John? I think it's 8 30. <laughs> it's changed all the time. Next Tuesday as well. I think we're on twice. I think there's EastEnders in between us. I oh, think we've, yeah. Brilliant. We're on twice. Are we propping EastEnders up again? Mm. Oh, Great to see you both. And good luck and congratulations. Thank you.